Hey guys, it's Amanda with Getting There Green and what you're looking at behind me here is a very large kale plant. This plant, uh, it's very tall, it's about uh, four feet or so tall. It is about two and a half year old plant and um, I'm doing this video because recently, well, maybe about two months ago, somebody asked me, when do you harvest kale seeds? And so I thought I'd do this video because right now is when you harvest kale seeds. At least for my plant, that is. As far as I know. <laughs> Actually, this is my first time harvesting kale seeds. But uh, if it's like most other plants, um, I know what to look for. <laughs> so, okay. This kale plant went to seed quite some time ago, but the seeds weren't ready to harvest. You could see this here. This is what they look like at first, when they first go to seed. There we go. It's um, just green, tiny little pod, looks like uh, a little bean pod, but really, really tiny. And that's not ready to pick yet. You have to wait it out. <laughs> when it is ready, it looks like this what looks like a brown dried up bean. Oops, I broke this one open so I probably already lost all the seeds out of it. Looks like a brown dried up bean and inside you open it and there's this thing in the middle and then there's peas on, or peas, um, let me see there's seeds on either side of this thing that's inside the pod and most of the time they just kind of ping off at me and I lose them on the ground which probably means I'm going to have lots of kale growing randomly in my greenhouse but like right now I just lost a seed okay so that's what they look like. Pretty small and you find a bunch about that many in those fairly big pods about that long and uh, far fewer only a couple in small pods but you need to wait until your pods are that brown color very tan color very very dry they're very easy to open and inside you have that middle piece and peas on, or I keep saying peas because that's what it looks like. Little seeds on either side of that. And I'm guessing, I don't know if it's that there's only a few in some of these pods or if the seeds have already fallen out. I don't know any special tricks, anything whatsoever about picking and harvesting kale seeds. I just um, waited until the pods were brown and dried up and figured that's when it's time to harvest the seeds. So there you go. Now if, uh, what is her name? BC Garden 2010. If you happen to be still watching our videos these couple of years later, this is actually the kale plant that we grew from the seeds that you gave us, which I think you probably harvested from your garden yourself as well. Okay guys, um, kale, the only thing I do know about kale is it takes about two years before it flowers and goes to seed. So that's how long you gotta wait. Anyway, I hope this video was at least a little bit informative, points you in the sort of the right direction if you are interested in harvesting your own kale seeds. Kale is very easy to grow. I'm growing I think three varieties of it this year and uh, I really like kale. I was introduced to it I guess two years ago and um, I really like it. Okay, talk to you later guys. Um, don't forget to check out our website and our thousand subscriber contest and both of our sponsors Manabu Gardens and Grassroot Gardens. Talk to you later, guys. Bye.